the second part of the tank battle tutorial. Please move to the route marker. type of shell causes more damage it would not be effective in this situation so shells with better armor penetration should be used switch to the alternative shell type available load hype. fire off your current shell to load the new type of shell that you've switched to Go ahead. you have switched to composite shells these shells successfully pierce almost any armor they cause lower damage. We failed to acquire the target! Destroy the target tank. Ready to fire! Yes, a hit! It serves him right! Go in! It. 
you can see that even though the composite shells make it possible to destroy a well-armored target, it takes quite a long time because of their low damage. Good job. Move to another Kabanir. Distances, you need to take into consideration that shells do not fly straight, but follow a parabolic path into account, meaning that they will fall to the ground once they pass a certain distance. For the shell to reach a distant target, the cannon should have a higher elevation. Accordingly, when you aim the targeting crosshair in sniper mode, or when the cannon orientation marker points towards the target, you will not be able to hit it. The shell will fall without reaching the opponent. To hit the opponent, no matter how far away they are, move the white crosshair onto them. It changes color when it is over the enemy. And fire. Fired shell flies along a ballistic trajectory, while the reticule shows where the cannon is aiming. If you shoot at a distant object using the reticule, the shell will drop before it reaches the target. Shooting at long distances, you need to take into consideration that shells do not fly straight, but follow a parabolic path into account. Accordingly, when you aim the targeting crosshair in sniper mode, or when the cannon orientation marker points towards the target, you will not be able to hit it. The shell will fall without reaching the opponent. To hit the opponent, no matter how far away they are, move the white crosshair onto them. It changes color when it is over the enemy. And fire. The fired shell flies along a ballistic trajectory, while the reticule shows where the cannon is aiming. If you shoot at a distant object using the reticule, the shell will drop before it reaches the target.
Nice shot. Great job. You won. Now you're a true tanker.